ninth house is a very important house and now we know that so is the ninth lord ninth lord being situated in different houses how does it react how does it work we will see that in today's video always remember the basic fundamentals of astrology all of these things that i am teaching you is about the results but before the interpretation of result we have to keep one thing in mind that if the planet is weak the planet will not be able to produce its result when i say weak i mean a combust planet a planet in a planetary war and a planet who is having less than 100% point in sudbal along with that you should understand that if the ninth lord is going into a bad company is debilitated is combust is going into a planetary war going into inimical rashi or if it is afflicted by malefic planets or afflicted by inimical planets by their aspect or by their conjunction in that particular scenario the negative results will be prominent in those particular houses where i am not saying you a negative result in that particular case the positive result you have to take negatively that it will not happen or opposite of what is being told will happen it should be interpreted in this particular way now coming to the ninth lord going into the first house it is one of the best combination such great combination it is that in the case of even those ascendants where the ninth lord is debilitated in the ascendant or like debilitated in navam shatra trine the ascendant it is considered to be a very very good placement because ninth lord in the ascendant is very good it makes the native very fortunate not only this ninth lord in the ascendant also indicates that person will be very successful in his professional life also he will have name fame prestige and honor most importantly it almost ensures either a government job or a job which is in connection to government where you are working for the government government is paying you money almost a very secure profession it does indicate it will also indicate that one will succeed in their homeland it will make one very very fortunate and it will also give spirituality to the native the native will be spiritual and he will progress much in spirituality having the vision of god and all of these things which are the results of spirituality will also be very prominently present in the life of the native along with this even the siblings of the native will be well to do and when needed they will help the native sometimes with this particular combination one can lose their money by doing bad investments but eventually they will be rich also these people will have multiple wealths multiple properties and will have multiple vehicles also they will also have children and they will be very proud of their children as their children will be very very successful but sometimes these people can be you know troubled by their enemies and they should make sure that not to create enemies in government or not to have enmity with elder people people who are worthy of respect otherwise it can be very problematic generally in such cases the life partner may come from a very humble background and the native will specifically right from the childhood the childhood of the native will be good the native is generally born in a well to do family and as the age passes by the native's condition becomes more and more stronger specifically the young age and the old age is specifically very good the person if not in government job will have uh, much name fame and status in foreign lands also and the income will be sufficient enough to meet the needs and fulfill the desires of the native almost the same result is there if the ascendant lord is in the ninth house right so i am not repeating it either ways with proper discrimination and taking the principles from my previous videos the ascendant lord in the ninth house you can also understand and while covering the ascendant lord i should have covered the ascendant lord in ninth house so you can refer to that particular video as well when the ninth lord is going into second house see this is a very good combination for wealth generally ninth lord in second house you get good inheritance and you get money by luck also but in this combination what i have seen that if the person is not hard working or if the person goes into the company of you know too much into company of friends then in that particular scenario though the person gets inheritance but he will lose that particular money 
and the help and support of luck in creating money is not there other than that the father may leave the native very early there can be bad relationships uh, there can be bad relationship with father and one may not get support from family in professions related to ninth house in government job working as a teacher teaching students working as a research scholar these professions are suitable to the native however the relationship with siblings are not very good and generally either siblings bring problem or liabilities to the native it is a good combination to have multiple properties and vehicles and it is also a very good combination to have a very successful and good children but if the person is too much into enmity or if the person is too much into competition then because of enmity the person can face disturbances in their professional life and can have problems in earning money generally this combination is not very good for marital life and generally this is also a combination where the person may cheat their life partner or may have more than one marriage if you are having this combination then you can take a pledge not to do it and it will be good because of this particular reason cheating the life partner or abusing the life partner physically verbally the marriage can break also so one should be very very careful about it not doing this is very important for the well being of the marriage any type of abuse even a little bit is very problematic the native sometimes can face such dire situations where they will have to spend all of their savings so one should always account of unexpected a loss of money and keep savings accordingly otherwise it is problematic in this particular scenario through investments one will earn good amount of money generally such people you will see that they have good rented income and things as such such person will also earn very well if they are hard working as i told in the starting if they are not hard working then they may not earn very well though they may get in returns but they not earn very well in the case when they are hard working these people will earn very well that is for very certain right and uh, these people can also be successful in foreign lands though going to foreign lands is not recommended this ninth lord and second house is also a combination where the person should live in their homeland and try to find work there only when the ninth lord is going into the third house it will expect the ninth house back making the person very fortunate but the third house is the house of hard work so the person will have to do the hard work secondarily the person will become more fortunate or the real result of this combination is felt only after the age of 40 45 most importantly one have to take risks in life to become more fortunate until and unless the person is risk taker they will not become successful so they will have to take some risks which people will say that it is a madness it is a financial madness but they should do that it will help them other than that some very bold decisions native will have to take like separating from family or going to foreign lands this people uh, this uh, this person have this such decisions this person should take uh, for their financial well being and to become more successful the person should also be well rested if the person is timid if the person thinks a lot before doing things in that particular scenario the luck may stay away right so i am not saying do things without thinking but don't take much time in thinking otherwise you may lose opportunities old age specifically is very good in this particular combination one's siblings will do well in life and they will often support the native right the native will not get much from inheritance but whatever they will get if they use it accordingly then it will be sufficient for the survival of the native most importantly daily visiting temple doing mantra chanting being spiritually active will make the native more fortunate in this particular scenario also children are very well to do and generally the children are more successful than the native himself which makes the native very very happy because of enmity competition jealousy in professional life and in personal life the person can be in can be in a lot of tension it can be difficult to manage things because of enmity so it is better to keep enmity at a minimum this is also a very potent combination for divorce in marriage divorce or separation in marriage so matchmaking should be done properly otherwise it can become very very problematic most importantly in this particular combination generally the life of the native is stable there are not many changes as such but the native have to be a risk taker though the life is smooth but native should keep on doing something otherwise this stability may you know stop the 
stop the growth of luck right generally in the matters of land and property person should try to maintain only one property and only one vehicle if the native tries to manage more than one property then they will see that maximum of their time and investment is going into management only without having much profit so this is something that the native should avoid the native will earn money and generally his income will be more than his needs so this is a good combination all and all if the ninth lord is going into fourth house then of course the native is fortunate in the matters of land and property the person can also get much inheritance and financial support from mother however the relationship with the uh, spouse of the life partner is not very good and many a times the native will have to support their siblings also the health of the mother generally is not good and the the mother of the native needs much care which the native himself will have to do this is not a very good combination for children many a time these people will have difficulties in having children and all of that for professions related to law or those professions where fighting is inevitable law etc this is a very good combination generally in this particular scenario though the person is lucky but the person have a lot of responsibilities over him also which when not managed properly can uh, push the native into depression like situation also so about this the native should be careful after the you know like after death of someone the native may see rise in his luck so his responsibilities will increase but the opportunities of income will also increase if the native takes the right step at right point of time then it will be very very good in the matters of profession generally contacts of the native will help so native should try to make more contacts which he can use well in his profession so in professional life the person should focus on contact building in the matter of uh, finances this is not a very good combination as such the person may have to struggle with respect to finances sometimes so this person should maintain good savings otherwise it will be problematic ninth lord going into fifth house is once again a very good combination for spirituality this person should visit temple do mantra chanting this way they will become more lucky and they will have all those things which they want in life right they will have more than what is needed but for that spirituality mantra chanting daily visiting temple is necessary this person having ninth lord in the fifth house generally their childhood is not very good their childhood they generally come from very humble origins they do much hard work in their young age and they enjoy in old age specifically with respect to wealth though the person will earn money through hard work the life partner will also come from good financial background or uh, going by the advice of the life partner the person will earn much or the life partner themselves can be working but when it comes to saving money the person can be a bit careless because of which there can be problems though child birth is late but the relationship with children is good at least one or two abortions or failed pregnancy is also indicated so person should plan uh, things accordingly because of enmity competition jealousy there can be loss of money so this should be avoided at at every cost otherwise even smallest of enmity or the jealous nature of the native will create much problems in the life of the native the person generally have a very stable life there are not many ups and downs after marriage there will be significant rise in luck and one will see that after marriage they are achieving things quite easily but this have a condition that you should have good relationship with your life partner as your condition with your life partner will deteriorate the result may fade also so one will have to be very careful about it in this particular combination one will change jobs very often when it is a very good setup one will change jobs very often because they will get the opportunities for uh, success quickly one after another and in the case when the ninth lord in the fifth house is afflicted in that particular scenario not having good relationship with their seniors and bosses can be problematic so one should work on to maintain good relationship with their seniors and try to impress them right see impressing your senior or making them happy is your prime purpose as an employee right so this you should try to do 
otherwise it can be problematic for you provided the fact you are having ninth lord and fifth house when the ninth lord is going into sixth house both type of cases are seen right ninth lord and sixth house you i will say ninth house is an upchay the person becomes happy as they grow older unexpected gain of money they can have as they grow older as they cross 30 35 years of age they become very lucky they are very successful in life but for this to happen the lagna lord have to be well placed or the 10th lord have to be well placed there should be rajyog in horoscope because if that is not there then in that particular scenario 9th lord going into 6th house keeps one struggling in the matter of fortunes the person even after doing much hard work cannot become fortunate they are not meeting the right people they are not getting the right opportunity even after doing much hard work they are not getting the recognition and the thing that they deserve is generally distributed to others so they should be very very careful about it most importantly because of children's there can be financial losses so one have to make very sure that they have a child only when they are financially stable and then they should not do things such as you know sending your child in a school that you cannot afford over expensive and other such things bad decisions related to children's one should not do specifically in this particular case it is very important to take education which supports the profession of the native because 80% of the time i have seen that the education and the profession of the native does not meet the requirements that is needed for each other and generally person for his professional life have to go through a separate uh, educational qualification person have to take separate educational qualification so that is something that is needed the relationship with the spouse of the sibling is very good though the relationship with sibling cannot be uh, is generally not very good but the relationship with the spouse of the sibling is very good and the spouse of the sibling is you know also someone who will favor you when it comes to you know any kind of problems in family in the matters of property and vehicle these people are lucky but somehow having multiple properties uh, simultaneously is not very easy so though the person always enjoys the luxury of home and property but they will get a new or better home and property only when they when they sell their previous home or property right so one should not try to like maintain one home and take another home also if they do this there will be added liability uh, which can become problematic for the financial future of the native for children's this is this is this is a good combination children's initially in the childhood they are problematic but as they grow older they are great support to the natives however there is separation oh, separation from child so either the child lives in foreign land or other such things happen right so the relationship is not very good in beginning later on the child gets settled in their own life so you are not much tensed about it they can you know they can like help you often also for female native ninth lord and sixth house is not a very good combination to have children and they can have difficulties in conception of child right in the matters of marriage this is good the life partner will be valorous the life partner will be risk taker the life partner will be the life partner will do lot of hard work but the life partner can be too much dedicated to their profession to such an extent that you may feel ignored so you know maintaining spark in marital life is very necessary and for that you will have to do the effort and hard work otherwise you may feel ignored from your life partner which is not a very good setup most importantly these people tend to have a particular tendency of ignoring the hard work of their life partner if they are doing that they should not do it if the life partner feels undervalued or not valued at all in that particular scenario marital life can be problematic these people will generally earn from inheritance and expected gain of money through stock markets etc is also very uh, is also very much uh, happening in multiple cases that i have seen so this is good in this particular regard and most importantly regarding professional life the person may have to struggle initially but after the age of 28 there is great rise in uh, profession and the person eventually goes to top in his professional life when the ninth lord goes to seventh house after marriage the native becomes fortunate listening to the advice of the life partner will increase the wealth of the native the life partner can be 
you know, professionally active as well, specifically in the case of female, this result is applicable, right? Sorry, specifically in the case of males, this horror, uh, this result is applicable in their horoscopes. The thing is that with uh, ninth lord in seventh house, this is a combination for more than one marriage or extramarital affair. In the case of extramarital affair, one should avoid having extramarital affairs and to avoid more than one marriage, one should match the horoscope properly that because despite the fact that after marriage, the person becomes very fortunate and the life partner can be a great financial support to the native. After some time, the native starts taking things for granted, <coughs> sorry, which can become problematic for the native. So this is something that they should keep in mind. These people generally progress when they, you know, leave their homeland and go to foreign countries or at distance, distant places to work then it is good for them. With regard to family, this is not a very good combination. Generally, these people are ignored by their family members. Their family members are ungrateful and there can be fights in family or family members can fight the native as well. So this is something regarding which the native should be very careful. One or more than one siblings of the native can be childless or can be without progeny. Regarding Home and property, the person generally gets home and property after the age of 40, 45 in life. But they are fortunate with, with regard to that. Fortunate with regard to that means whatever home and property they will make, they will be able to live into that and they will enjoy it also. To have child, child one have, but they do not get this child very easily after, you know, after waiting for the right point of time and after multiple after multiple failed uh, try of conception, the native will eventually get a child. Right. Animity and competition will give success to the native. The native is generally victorious over their enemies and victorious in competition. But they will have to do this struggle for victory for a very long time. So it is better not to have uh, any type of enmity as such. Generally, if things are struck in court cases, etc. say there is court case or there is some litigation in the property, then generally this person wins the litigation, but it is not a very good setup, right? So if you can avoid this particular litigation related to land property vehicle or the belongings of the mother or the belongings of the family, make sure like not to go into court cases and uh, settle things amicably. When the ninth Lord is going into eighth house, it is one of the worst combinations in like astrology. I don't like to use this word one of the worst combinations because any analysis is subjected to multiple parameters, but still when the ninth lot is going into eighth house, the person is generally not very fortunate. The father may either, you know, like one may lose their father early or because of being in the shadow of the father, because of the father being very successful, the native may not be much successful or native can be too much dependent on their father. So first thing that is necessary is come out of the shadow of your father and start something of your own. Do not be much dependent on your father or expect much from him, though he can meet your expectations and all of that is good. Right. But it will hamper your growth. And after the demise of the father, the life can go in a downward turn. Right. So this is something that is important in the matters of home. The person can have, you know, like the family members can be hostile towards the native, right? But it is very good for savings. The person will have good income and specifically from their profession, the person will earn well. They will be highly placed in their profession and they will be respected in their profession. Also provided the fact that they start something other than what their father is already doing and they do not live under the shadow of their father. Siblings can have a tensed marital life because of which there can be tension in family. And because of the tense to marital life of the native, they may also have to sometimes step in to rescue their sibling, rescue their siblings. Right. Uh, with respect to home property and vehicle, the person can have accidents while driving vehicles. So first of all, they should be careful. Secondarily, with respect to home person will generally make property only after the age of 40. Right. So these things are significantly delayed. In the case of woman, this is not a very good setup for childbirth. Abortions delay in childbirth can, can be there. For male natives, though they can have children with this combination also, but the relationship with the child is not very cordial. And, uh, you know, child can be a reason for, like child can be problematic in young, in young age. And after the child grows up, the person, because, because of the life of the child, 
which is not very stable, the person have to be tensed about their child. Right. Enmity, competition, jealousy. Though one is successful in successful over enemies and one will successfully win over their enemies. But if this includes financial win, then in that particular case, it is not a complete win. One have to do compromise only. Specifically, this combination indicates that in the rage of anger, one can do something to their enemies or in the rage of jealousy, one can do something which can be detrimental for the name, fame, prestige, goodwill of the native, which one should avoid at all cost. In this particular scenario, the life partner can be very much attached to their own family and the life partner may give more importance to her family than to yours family. This you have to understand and should make your life partner understand as well. The sibling of the life partner may not do well in life and can come to you as a responsibility. Right. And, and like if you are able to support them, then you should because helping the siblings of the life partner will specifically be very fortunate for you. And one can lose money on account of uh, because of government and government governmental officials also. So try not to have enmity with governmental officials and try not to do things which goes against the uh, policies of the government. Otherwise, it can be very, very problematic for the native. Ninth Lord in ninth house, the native is very successful. The native is very lucky. Right from childhood till the old age, native is very lucky. Though in middle ages, the native may have to do some hard work. But that is okay. Specifically in the old age, much name, fame, prestige owner is there. Native is famous, native is fortunate, native is owned. Native is, you know, native will get much support from family. Native will get good inheritance. Earning money through lottery, speculations, stock market, investments is will happen. One will have multiple properties and multiple vehicles. The life of everyone around the native will be well settled. So they will never need the native, which will make the life of the native stable as well. Native will be fortunate in matters of children, so specifically women are very fortunate in the matters of children. And this is a combination where the native will enjoy the company of children and grandchildren peacefully and will live in peace. The life partner can be egoistic, arrogant, short tempered, but they will do all the efforts to keep you happy, to keep you happy. And they will do all the efforts that are needed from their side. They will leave no stone unturned to participate, uh, you know, to, to participate properly in all your efforts and do all the things that are expected from them. There is not much enmity, like there is not much enmity around the native. The native is also self-satisfied, contented almost. And enmity and all of enmity competition does not bother the native because he is fortunate. He will meet the right person at right point of time. He will get the right opportunities. He will get promotions at right point of time. And all of these things will be there. So it is not much of a problem. With the relatives of the mother, if the native does something with relatives of the mother, maternal uncle, maternal aunt, doing investments with them or having a business partnership with them, with them or taking their advice before doing anything, will be very fortunate for the native. This, if one can, they should. One is also very fortunate in the matter of income. One will earn good amount of wealth and will be rich. In the society where they live, they will be at one of the top positions in that society. Ninth Lord going into 10th house makes a great Rajyog. The life of the person is easy. The person is at the top position in their profession. They have good contacts and many things are very easily done because only because of the good contacts that they are having. The native is well settled in life. They earn very well. They have name, fame, prestige, owner, people respect them. They have good position and status in their professional life. They are almost irre irreplaceable. There can be some tension with family. There can be enmity with family members, but these people will be supported by their siblings. One, you know, mother, uh, you know, mother can have like, first of all, mother will come from a humble background. Secondarily, mother will need much support, attention and affection from the native. But 
because of mother one will also gain things so inheritance from the mother's side or you know good results after following the advice of the mother is also there one will have multiple properties and vehicles but in old age after the age of 40 only with respect to children this uh, placement can be little bit problematic at problems because of children's problem in having progeny will be there so one have to plan it accordingly with proper dasha and after taking the proper guidance from uh, doctor only one should plan for child otherwise it may result in failed pregnancy or abortions or things like that Be generally in professional life there is competition and enmity to the native but the native will be successful over it and because the native is at a ruling position it will not bother the native much because of the risks of the life partner because of the temper temperament of the life partner because of the ethics and morals of the life partner the person can sometime feel uneasy because of the valor and uh, prestige and self respect of the life partner there can be tension in the family life of the native also and there can be tension between the native and the life partner as well so one should try to develop understanding and emotional connect with the life partner and multiple bad things which can be ignored one should try to ignore only then it will ensure happy marriage otherwise uh, it can be problematic the untimely death or demise of someone may shock the native and may create much turmoil in their life so one have to be well prepared in advance about any such things if they like one should always be these are unexpected things so one should always be prepared for it otherwise there can be a great there can be a great hit on the the mental condition and the financial condition of the native with investment ninth lord and 10th house with proper investments the person can expect very good returns of money and one can expect to be one of the you know one of the highly influential person in the society however without proper investment this combination is not very conducive for making wealth so if the person is not much into investment then in that particular scenario one will only have one of the top position in their profession but may not earn well for good earning and for good income for riches to be there person have to invest properly also only then things will be good ninth lord in 11th house makes the native very fortunate in the matter of money one will earn good amount of money one will be rich they will get good support from family also they can engage in family business as well the old age of the life is specifically very good one is owned by government elders and higher authorities one can earn through government also ninth lord and ninth house ninth lord and 10th house ninth lord and 11th house all three are a very good combinations for either getting a government job or doing a job which is directly connected to the government where the government is paying which also means that the native will have very stable income and their financial condition will improve day by day their spouse will specifically be very fortunate after marriage and the uh, sorry their uh, sibling will be will be very fortunate after marriage and sibling and the spouse of the sibling both will come to come as a very great help to the native in the times of need this native is specifically very lucky in the matters of uh, vehicles having prop having multiple vehicles is there in the case of property though it is not a very good combination but one will have uh, their home and they will enjoy in that home for sure right this is also very good combination for childbirth in female horoscope this may delay childbirth but they will have child for sure in male horoscopes this is a very good combination for childbirth so this is brilliant in this combination one can be disturbed very often by their enemies and people who are jealous from them so one should be careful about not having enmity and if they are having it then one should be very careful about not letting people know much about your personal life otherwise people who are jealous of you can also create problems in your life can you know put false allegations on you and can put problems uh, uh you know create problems in your life and in your path so do not share much personal details publicly or to people around you because in this combination one will have good friend circle and one will uh, when one have good friend circle it is a common nature that one shares much detail about themselves which is well known to everyone around them but this should be avoided for their betterment the life partner is good life partner is well to do life partner belongs from a well to do family but the native will have to support and guide life partner multiple times because 
spouse can do some bad investments which can lead to losses also spouse can suffer depression and other such issues and at this crucial points of time at this crucial point of time the native will have to first of all be prepared for it secondarily support the life partner properly because generally in marriage what happens then when a life partner is going through challenging mental times you may not understand it you may ignore it you may laugh over it which can worsen the situation so first of all be careful about it and take proper care of your life partner otherwise it can become problematic life partner will also be very successful in their own personal life so that will be a very great support for you life partner will also be very intelligent will be very academically qualified and uh, taking their advices in whatever you do will be very very beneficial for you that also you should do and the spouse may be very much connected to their own siblings which if it is too much it can create an interference in your marital life also so regarding this you should sit and talk and try to you know try to like minimum involvement of the siblings of spouse in your marital life is better for its good condition it's better for your marital life otherwise too much involvement of the siblings of the life partner can uh, become problematic for your life so this is something that should be kept in mind if the ninth lord is going into 12th house in this particular scenario after being initiated in a tradition after being spiritually activated after you know being devoted to a guru person becomes fortunate can earn good amount of money otherwise this is a bad combination where the person will struggle he will always see that he is not getting right recognition and awards of his efforts and he is generally being ignored by people all of this can be remedied by being initiated in a sect and following a guru wholeheartedly one should also whenever one see one one comes to find that some temple is being built or you know some religious institutions needs any type of assistance they should provide it if they do it they will be uh, you know they will become more and more fortunate and then they will see that there is great rise in their financial social societal standards right in in their uh, life standard itself you see father can be absent so death of father separation between mother and father or ignorance from the side of father can be there in this particular case specifically the old age of the native is very good the native will have good international contacts good name fame and status with proper investments the native will get good returns but generally in this particular case native is a spend thrift a habit which is not very bad but calculated expenditure is always good uncalculated expenditure where you do not save any money for tough times is problematic and can uh, land the problem into uh, land the native into uh, problems which will at least push the native financially push the native 5 to 10 years back so this is something that should be avoided there can there will be uh, you know there, there will be ignorance from family members which is something that cannot be avoided one have to live with it the siblings will be great support to the native and generally having good relationship with siblings making them happy giving them gifts over time or on a regular basis will be, will be very beneficial for the a professional and a financial well being of the native in the case of uh, property and vehicle the native can have property and vehicle but they will have to take loans for it so maintaining things accordingly so that you get a loan very easily one should maintain and secondarily if one you know like as i told before if one He spends all the money into taking a uh, purchasing a home or purchasing a property. Then it can be a, a careless or careless expenditure of money, which can then create problem in the native's life. So it is better to take loans and uh, make all the arrangements beforehand only. That is good. In the case of female native, though this combination delays childbirth, but is but it promises child for sure. for the male native this combination is not very good for childbirth there can be delay or denied childbirth and in the case when they have children the children's can be 
you know the children's can be problematic there can be issues problems struggles because of the child so one should do parenting properly with proper planning otherwise uh, the child can go into bad company also the child can have vices as well because of which the native can be in problem because of enmity because of jealousy because of competition the person may feel tensed he will have a feeling of depression because he will not be able to do much in this regard it is better not to have enmity and if you have enmity ignore it giving much of your time into enmity is not recommended going too much into court cases or picking up court cases for things is not advised even in the matter of court cases first of all one should do a good lawyer and uh, secondarily one should try to settle it as soon as possible otherwise it will be problematic one should be very careful about their health this is a particular setup where the person can be ignorant about their health which will be problematic in later times which will be problematic later on so one should be careful about it for marriage this is good the life partner can be very valorous the life partner can be very courageous the life partner can be a great risk taker right and listening to the life partner will generally bring fortune to the native so one should listen to their life partner but the life partner can be ignorant about themselves the life partner can be ignorant about their health and life partner can be ignorant about the hazards that are uh, related to the things that they are doing and decisions that they are making you should first of all make them aware of it and secondarily will should try to protect your life partner always otherwise it can be problematic though this combination is good for inheritance but the gain of inheritance can be significantly delayed and one should only take because in this particular combination one will also get a chance of claiming things which he does not uh, you know which is not his by the law right but if the person misuses this particular chance once and claims something which is, which does not belong to him but he claims it then it is a one time profit only and later on the financial condition etc of the native deteriorates only so native should be careful about not claiming those things which are not his own being very careful about it and in that particular scenario if one is careful about it then one will keep on uh, you know being more fortunate and uh, will will keep on becoming more prosperous and more affluent over time otherwise it can be problematic so this is something that they should take care of there can be losses because of fights with governmental employees there can be losses because of you know not following the rules and regulations of the government so about this one should be very careful and one should keep this in mind in professional life there will be international uh, contacts name fame status which the native will reap to his benefit but in his profession the native may feel that all the effort that he is doing is not getting recognized properly he is doing more hard more he is doing more hard work but not getting appropriate results this will be there for some point of time with which the native should compromise later on all this effort that the native have done throughout the years will be amply rewarded but one have to have patience for it so this was the result of ninth lord in different houses and as i told you in the starting as per the strength of planet and the influence of planet over other planets one have to modify it and understand accordingly right with respect to different house lords in the ninth house i have covered that in the in the videos that were uh, related to the different houses so you can have a look over that and please make a conclusion only after proper analysis of the horoscope only then it will be a successful analysis and only then you can expect an accurate prediction otherwise only considering one factor only considering one uh, combination and then expecting the analysis to be correct the analysis to be right and the prediction to be correct is a uh, very childish right so avoid doing that and uh, thank you for